You need spray. I thought you were supposed to. I said that we wasn't going to do that. There's two ways to do this. Why we didn't do it the way we learned? <laughs> But anyway, hey y'all, hi, I'm back on y'all screen. So we back in the beauty room, getting it together, and we have started the project on the chairs. Now look, listen, let me say this. Gail ain't doing it like, you know, we was talking. You are supposed to spray the chair, then use the paint to put on the chair, but she's doing it her way. Because when I talked to Annie, I called Annie. Yeah, she talking about Annie Salone. She don't even know her. I spoke to her and she said, Gail, <laughs> Okay. There's more than one way to do anything. Okay, tell us what she said. Put the way that works for you and your chair. Okay. That's what she said. Okay. And call her if I had any other questions. Girl. So follow me. Okay, so we're going to follow Gail, and I'm about to follow suit. I'm about to get up and do my chair, and hopefully it turn out. She'll look close to the wall. You like we're gonna, color? Uh-huh. We're going to keep, not really, but it's going to work. Damn, it's looking blue. <laughs> No, that's cute. It's actually cute. It looks cute. And we're going to keep the original legs on this chair and just spray paint them, honey. Uh, oh, I wish I could remember that girl's name. I don't know who it was that was like, what'd she say, Gail? What'd she say? Say it. What'd she say? She about said, the chair, about the leg being backwards and crooked on the chair. And, um, like, but look. <laughs> What? Yeah, she caught Did that. In, know? Yeah, she caught that in the video. Oh, I actually like that's cute. I what think my you? white pillow look cute sitting in that it chair. Sure will. Yeah. So okay, yeah, I'm about to start on this chair over here, and um, yeah, hopefully I can record this because of course this is my vlog camera. I'm not going to be setting up for this. As you can see, we have our snacks. We have some skin, some cracklings, some. Uh, hot dogs with no bread. Gail has a wine. I have my energy drink. And yeah, that's how we gonna do this today, baby. We gonna do this. I don't right, know. gonna try to get back on track today. <laughs> okay, let me get the box. That's gonna be pretty. So I'm gonna let Gail do it her way, do it the way Annie Salon um, taught her how to do it, and we're gonna do it how the YouTubers did it. So I got my hair spray bottle here, y'all. This is so cool. This is like an aerosol look. Mm -hmm. That is so cool. So yeah, hold on. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Oh shit, the hat going on. It's about to go down. Hey. <laughs> about to go down got that turban baby tv she got me doing that in every cleaning video so anyway hey y'all hey it's about to go down girl <laughs> i might need to turn some light on oh thank you jesus but is it good oh it's perfect for the camera so look, listen, you don't really want to wet this chair because you have to let the chair dry and sand in between coats so you won't be waiting so long. Do not soak the couch. Just get it wet. Um, I don't know how wet. Cause wet enough, enough to thin about. your paint out. Oh, wet enough to thin your paint out. As you apply it. As you apply it. So I'm going to wet it just a bit here as you go like that. You know, like so. Can y'all see Gail? Yeah, y'all yeah, can see her too. I'm ready to sit down. Oh, Lord. No, <laughs> no she ain't y'all. <laughs> so, what you want me to do, Gail? Dip my paint in here? Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you, are, you don't need to wet your brush. I'm doing that because I didn't spray mine down. So, I wet my brush a little bit. Okay. Let me get some water. Mm -hmm. Let me get some water. 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 Why is it on TV? She took she drank my wine. <laughs> Did I drink your she wine? She drank my wine. <laughs> <laughs> that was more than just a sip. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry I drank your wine. I drank the blood, I drank the wine. <laughs> can y'all see? Y'all can see. I hope y'all can see. I'm so excited about this. I know, right? Yeah. Get this beauty room together. This is the first step to getting it together, though. Second step. Uh, what's the second first step? Cutting your table. Oh, the, yeah, cutting the table, and the rest gonna come easy. Mm 
does it matter in which angle you put no paint? no i don't think so but now your pattern does kind of go up and down so you might want to paint up and down but when i did my chair shit i did circles and rounds and i don't think it matters for real oh what do you want to uh give me some more wine man oh okay <laughs> I'ma wet this, y'all. Start on this side here. Oops, that's a little too wet. Can y'all see it? Rub your drips in. I am. Wish I had another little small little brush there. Yeah. That would be better than that. To get in the cracks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, I just I had to work. It, and know. you know what I would do? I would say, yeah, I was gonna say, I've, I've been kind of working my brush into the cracks, That's but nice. I think that I'll save my cracks for last because it's so hard on the brush, you know? Okay. I don't know, just. Just a thought, okay. Yeah, like a later thought based on what I went through and looking at the condition of that brush. Already? Not yours, mine. Oh, because I just got it. <laughs> uh, this is a workout. This could be just what the doctor ordered, sure, because my arm hurt, girl. Down this ball. Yeah, they can. You can see me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I know you can see me, but no, I can see what you're sure. doing. Yeah. Oh, I forgot to show y'all brush we have. Still got the packaging, but it's like a round stippling type brush. And Salon have them online somewhere, but we got these from Michaels. They work just the same. And hers is like $30 and $45 for one little brush like this. So yeah, how much was this at Michaels? It was $17. $17. We had a 50% off coupon. So it was $17 and she had a 50% off coupon. So whatever price that is after that, that's how much these cost. So, okay, y'all, this is what we got so far. Oh, that's tight. Well, anyway, as you can see, she has one arm done. I have one arm done. It's the opposite. And this is what we have so far. Once we paint the whole entire your chair, we have to let this dry, sand, and then add a second coat. And I think the second coat will do it, and then we'll add the gloss. But, um, yeah, this is what we have so far now. So, okay, y'all, I'm back on your screen, honey. I had to change clothes. I got a little hot. You know, I had to go find some old paint clothes and some pants, you know, because I kept cracking y'all up, and I didn't want y'all to be looking at that. So, but, um, you look so pretty in that blue hat. <laughs> Say hi, girl. Say hey. 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 <laughs> Okay, y'all, the whole entire chair is covered with the first coat. And this is how they're looking. Yeah! <laughs> so we need to do the cushions and then, yeah, like I said, we'll be back tomorrow to sand, I guess. And, uh, but look at that. I'm so excited about this. And that's how it's going to look with those silver legs it's so cute i love it <laughs> this is my first official diy baby because y'all know i don't fool with diys baby i am not about that life but today i am honey yeah and girl, get your paint on girl thank you so much for helping me <laughs> It's so cute, look at it, yeah. So anyway, yes y'all, we ain't talking about nothing. Gail ain't talking about nothing, I ain't talking about nothing. So, 
We'll see y'all when we turn this camera back on. So, okay, y'all, I'm back on y'all's screen. So, this is the chairs all complete with the first coat as well as the pillows. I did want to come back and let y'all see the pillows. I'm going to go buy another chair just to get these two front legs off. They of. cute, aren't they? Yes, just for that. Y'all look so cute on my camera. Hey, y'all. Hey. Hi. There go my favorite girls in the world. Yes, baby. Yes. She our favorite girl, too? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, you look so pretty in this camera. That blue, blue looks good on you. I always tell you that. Sugar. Blue is your color. Just like I look good in red you do. and pink. You do. Blue is your color. Yeah. Hey. Hey. D I Y. Hey. Not bad, I know. <laughs> right. I am so excited about this. It's so cool. Yeah. Uh oh, the battery's about to go dead. Gail and I will see y'all when we turn this camera back on. Hey. 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 Late night. I love this camera. I feel sprinkles on my arm. What sprinkles? What's a sprinkle. What? Oh, I thought it was raining. I know you lie. <laughs> no, I'm playing. <laughs> Girl, we ain't talking about nothing. See y'all, we turn this camera back on. <laughs> so, hey y'all, hey, I'm back on y'all screen, sitting in my room, chilling. <laughs> I'm so excited about this room. I can't wait until it gets done. Like, it's gonna take a minute because I don't have a lot of furniture to put in there. Hey. Hey, princess. Hey, mommy. <laughs> Who seen this song? Uh, Alex and Noah. So hey y'all, hey. Hey friend, hey. I'm back on your screen. Look, listen. It is the next day. Yes, I look a little busted. I am super tired. We didn't go to bed till like 3 a.m. And we got right back up at 7 a.m. But anyway, um, we in the process of doing the sandy on the chairs. And let y'all see the progress on that. Mm -hmm. They mine. Yeah. Yeah. So this seem like... Maybe this is addicted. I don't know. Let me spill it. Huh. It's soft back there? Huh? Is it soft? Yeah. And once we sand it, then we can put the second coat on it. Mm hmm Sand it and suck up, take the vacuum, I guess, and try to hose up all this dust off of it. Sand dust and then do the second coat. Okay, y'all, round two, we have painted, we have sanded, and now we're about to put the second coat of paint on the chairs. They are now back to normal. They are now back soft. Now we're about to make them hard again with the second coat of paint. So yeah, let's get to painting. Brush it up and down. You can't brush it high. Uh huh. Oh. I go all different directions. I was just trying to see if up and down work better. Okay. That's why you're doing it. Mm hmm. I was trying to see if that made a difference. Now we're back in the beauty room. So this is what it's looking like so far with the second coat. Check out the difference. A second coat made. And this is the last coat, honey. We are done. We just need to sand with uh, our grip paper. In between coats, we did sand like I told you all. The first sandpaper we used was, I think, 350. And for this last sanding, we're going to use 400 grit paper because this give it a smoother texture. And um, let Gail tell it, the higher the number, smoother 
it will be and yes she never lied i sand this part up here and it's so smooth compared to you hear the difference you hear that and then up here it just sound like a regular chair like i love it i'm so excited we are more than halfway through don't you agree gail oh yeah we just need the sand and and we're going to seal it with this wax here and we'll be done we're back this is a whole nother day but look listen y'all we've done the painting we sand we added our second coat and we sand it and now we are now putting the wax on i'm gonna go ahead and show you all the paint because i don't know if i showed you all the paint the color that we chose i don't know the color oh onyx gray is what I chose for my chairs and, and this is a chalk paint and I got this from Home Depot now I did tell you about the brush while we were painting the chairs but this is the brush that a lot of people use that Annie Salon sell and like I said they like 40 bucks and she has like three different sizes, so the price actually goes up but again we purchased this from Michaels and if you watched the whole video you already know I gave the price I can't remember because we had got a discount on it but you can get this particular brush from Michaels yeah it works the same as any salons brush you hear what I'm saying you know what I'm saying well we don't know how any salons brush works but we know this brush did the job oh there you go thanks <laughs> yes there you go fix that <laughs> they ain't even no disclaimer we just saying over right, here <laughs> right, <we just> saying. <laughs> so okay so at this point we had already started applying the wax we've already applied it from here to about down here and um yeah i will give you a better view of this once we get you know we could turn a chair around because i think the lighting from this way is a little different but as you can see i'll turn around I want to turn around this way so you can see the chair itself um this is the chair i think it looks really really good it turned out so good onyx gray is actually darker than what it turned out and i am really satisfied because this is the kind of gray that i really wanted i didn't really want a dark charcoal type of gray and with the sanding which is my fault because i did sand a little hard so gail kind of had to fall in suit because i sanded a little hard and it kind of made it light which i'm excited about it <laughs> No, I made it pink again. <laughs> well, but it still is lighter than yeah. what I originally showed. You did a good job. Yeah, so I like it. I really love it. Gail bought this paint. I don't even think she knew what shade of gray I wanted. And she came back with that and it worked out well. I'm telling you. It looks like we bought them out the store. And we purchased these from the Goodwill, as you all know. I mean, it was a thousand vlogs back when we showed you all these chairs. But yeah, they were pink. You all knew that. And this is what they're looking like now. And we did purchase these legs from Home Depot. And we spray painted them silver because they were in the natural wood. And um, yeah, I'm talking a little bit too much. Let's get our wax on. And I'll be back to show you the final result. good enough like what's wrong okay so how about this how about we don't do that chair with this wax we do that chair with the wax i got from michael's and see if that makes a difference really pissed Do we do the whole tree? She said, I'm so mad right now. 
I don't know if I should be or not. I just don't understand. Should we paint over it? Mm-hmm. And just buff it out? I just out? want to, yeah, do the paint again. And uh, call it a day. Maybe just try the Michaels paint, the, the Michaels wax, but I'll do it in a discreet place first to see if it'll take. Oh, wow. Look at that. So, hey, y'all, hey, we're back on your screen. Look, listen, listen. We have started to buff the wax end. Um, this is one of those trial and error type of situations. Now, we didn't buff this chair over here. However, we did do the arm, and it's doing the same thing. As you can see, it's turning white. So, we're going to try a different wax to see if that's going to work. But right now, at this point, we're going to paint over this and just buff it out with the 400 grit paper and see what happens from there. I just want to come back and try to just like keep it real 100 with y'all. And um, this wax is not working. Now when Gail did her chairs at home, she used a different wax than this wax here. I can't recall or I can't remember the wax she used, but I did show, show you all in the previous vlog which wax she did use. So if you did try this, I suggest you not get this wax. I don't know if we're doing it wrong, but we did it as directed on the back of the can. Like, I don't know why. Also, this is the wax that Bear itself recommends when using Bear Chalk Paint because it says after you have used the Bear Chalk Paint, decorative chalk paint use this wax but anyway as gail was saying gail you said what i do not recommend using bare products on fabric dyeing we used the michaels product the first time and it turned out beautifully none of this so i don't i don't i don't like this okay so at this point we're going to go back over with the paint and hopefully this will take away this white Spotting that we are seeing uh, yes. overcast. Yeah, it is terrible. So, uh, again, like I said, this one of those trial and errors take from us. This dish wax do not work. Well, it didn't work for us. So, yeah, I guess we'll see you all once we repaint this and when we turn this camera back on. So, hey, y'all, hey, I'm back. Oh my God, we are finally done with this project. This is the finished product of the chairs that we <laughs> DIY with chalk paint. Look, listen, we did have this, that mishap with the wax. We did use a different wax on these chairs than we did on the other one that I showed you all at Gale House. So what we did was we just went back over the white cast that the wax left. We just went back over with a th very very thin coat of the paint we actually watered it all the way down and just went over it and then we re-sanded it and um yeah this is the final product they turned out great they are back soft back to normal like they should be feeling and um yeah let me throw some pills in here and see what it look like so i just threw some pillows in there just so y'all can see what it look like you know if i did put some pillows in the chair or whatever so yeah this is it y'all we are finally done i am so happy it took about a day or two to complete but it took us longer because we ran out of time and plus we had to go to work so it took us about four days to complete this it will not take you that long if you have the time to devote to your project of chalk painting you know your fabric chairs or whatever it won't take you that long because you just need time for it to dry the first day I suggest waiting a whole entire day the second day shouldn't be too bad because you're not really gonna put that much paint on it all depends on the color of your chair and what paint you choose let me say that so but anyway that's enough talk that's enough rambling i got going on y'all i ain't really talking about nothing y'all i really hope you enjoyed this video so i'll just see y'all when i turn this camera back on so until next time until the next video bye bye hey.